All right, we just arrived. So this is the first service call of the day. Um, now for this specific customer, he's got two seven and a half ton splits um, and they each come off a one three quarter inch drain. So every couple of weeks he has to call us out. We have to come out and flush it, clean out the pans, vacuum everything out. Um, we've recommended to change from one three quarter to two one inch to, and to isolate each air conditioner with its own separate drain. Um, and he's just running the place. He doesn't necessarily want to put the money into the repair. Um, so he does the bare minimum every time, but I'll show you guys kind of what we've done and what we do and how it's kind of set up. Give you guys a good idea how to fix it. So flooded AC, that's where it is. Yeah, get up and put a ladder. All right, so we're up in the ceiling. Emergency pan's completely full. So this is the back end of the air conditioner. The front of it is on that side. We're gonna take the water out of this pan and then I'm gonna clean the drain. Where did you connect that? There's a little hole in there? Yeah, I see it. Gotcha. So now we're doing this side of the pan. So for something like this, this whole pan is being hung up by something like that. That's how it's holding up the pan, like this. All right, so you have a seven and a half ton package unit. Right here, you have this drain, which is three quarter, going into another seven and a half ton package unit, which is also three quarter, way too tiny. So hold the trap to vacuum it. I got the vacuum set up outside. So we have two of those three quarter inch drains. They connect to a one inch T um, inside the chase. And it comes down into this pipe, which is the most ridiculous setup ever. All right, and there you have it. It's draining away. So that should probably last another couple weeks. That's probably all we're really gonna get out of it. But I told him what he can do is just shove a vacuum in there once every two weeks to see if it will help. 